This morning, new research may answer a question that has stumped top doctors since the start of the pandemic. I have been puzzled from the beginning, but it is very strange how one individual can get infected and have either mild or no symptoms, and another individual could rapidly deteriorate. Now, two studies published Wednesday suggest people with type O blood may be less affected by COVID-19. Danish researchers sampled almost half a million COVID tests and found people with other blood types were more likely to test positive than those with type O. While a second Canadian study found people with O or B blood appear to have less severe symptoms. Even finding of all the 95 critically ill patients involved in their study, those with A and AB type blood were more likely to require dialysis and to be put on a ventilator. I was just having really like difficulty breathing, shortness of breath. I was fatigued. Lisa Merck was hospitalized with COVID in March and says she still experiences flare-ups. Her blood type, A positive. Still, there is no evidence to suggest that any blood type is either totally protected or doomed. As far as other possible risk factors, multiple studies have found men develop worse symptoms and are more likely to die from COVID-19. While there's no evidence of a genetic link between minorities and COVID, one study found black and ethnically mixed patients are three times more likely to be hospitalized. People of color are also more likely to have underlying health conditions, dense living situations, and be considered an essential worker, all making minorities more susceptible to COVID-19, as more light is shed on the novel virus. For today, Kristen Dahlgren, NBC News.